Good morning children. Have a nice day. Standard 7th Geography Unit 2. The name of the lesson Tourism. It's a very interesting topic. You know, there is most of them you like this uh, word tour. Another one it is on the picnic. Now let us go to that uh, lesson Tourism. The word tourist was derived from an old English word and the old English word Turian. Turian, the old English word it is on the Turian. Which refer to a person who travel out of his visual, out of his usual environment for not more than one year and less than 24 hours. The purpose of travel may be religious, recreation, business, historical and cultural. So next in the basic components of tourism. Tourism has become an important source of income for many regions, even for entire countries of the world. Tourism is an essential part of life of society because of its direct impact on social, cultural, educational and economic sector of nation and on the international relation to the three major the three the three main components of the three main components of the tourism attractions accessibility amenities attraction accessibility amenities so attraction it is a two division one is on the natural attraction and another one is a cultural attraction now let us discuss the topic attractions these three concepts are together known as a a3 concept a3 concept attraction attraction mainly comprise of the two types such as natural attraction and another one Cultural attraction. Natural attraction include landscape, seascape, beaches, climatic condition and forest. Cultural attraction are the historic monuments and other intellectual creation. Apart from this cultural attraction also includes fairs and festivals. So next accessibility. Accessibility means reachability to a Peculiar place of attraction through various means of transportation such as road, rail, water and air. Transport decide the cost of travel and the time consumed in reaching or accessing a specific attraction. And the next one, amenities. Amenities are the facilities that cater to the needs of tourists. Accommodation. In terms of hotels, restaurants, cafe and other staying units. Travel organizer, tour operators and tra travel agents. Foreign exchange centers, passport and visa agencies. Sectors related to the travel insurance and safety and security. So that is uh, the A3 concept is adapted in the tourism. It's a basic, on, it's a basic components of the tourism attraction. Accessibility, another one, amenities. So next, uh, discuss the topic, types of tourism, religious tourism, eco-tourism, historical tourism, cultural tourism, recreational tourism, international tourism. So, so many tourism is there. So now, uh, let us learn the Topic, let us learn the topic religious tourism. So the religious tourism is one of the oldest type of tourism. It is one of the oldest type of tourism. Religious tourism is one of the oldest type of tourism wherein people travel, wherein people travel individually or in group for pilgrimage to religious. Pilgrimage that means what children? Holy place. To a religious location such as temple, churches, mosque 
and other religious places. Religious tour to Kasi by Hindus, to Jerusalem by Christian, to Mecca by Muslims are the few example of the religious tourism. So next, eco tourism. Eco tourism no. This is a naturally preserved environment. It is a naturally preserved environment. It is a eco tourism. It focuses on visit. Eco tourism typically involves travel to destinations where plants and animals thrive in a naturally preserved environment. So, for example, Amazon rainforest, African forest safari. Tricking in the slopes of Himalayas are the famous, incredible, eco-friendly attraction. Eco-friendly attraction. So, next, historical tourism. Historical tourism. It is, uh, it focuses on visiting historical important places. Historically important places. Like museum, monuments, archaeological areas, fort, temples and so on. For example, Taj Mahal of India and the pyramids of Egypt are some of the examples to the court of the historical tourism. So, religious tourism that means one of the oldest type of the tourism, the varying travel individually in a group, individually in a group to another pilgrimage places, that is the holy places. And another one, it is uh, ecotourism. It is uh, mainly it is uh, uh, protect another so nature, plant and animals. And another one, uh, it is on the historical tourism. It is a focus on visiting historically important places. So next, uh, adventure tourism. Recreational tourism, international tourism, adventure tourism, to travel to remote or exotic places, it is on the adventure tourism. Adventure tourism is a type of tourism involving travel to remote or exotic places in order to take part in physically challenging outdoor activities. Physically challenging outdoor activities, for example, sky drive in Australia, mount, mountaineering in the in the peaks of Himalayas, rifting in the Brahmaputra River at Arunachal Pradesh, and another one recreational tourism. This type of the tourism, so this type of the tourism aim at enjoyment, aim at enjoyment. Amusement or pleasure or mainly for and fun activity. Fun activity, waterfalls, hill station, beaches and uh, amusement parks are the attractive, attractive spots of the recreational tourism. Apart from this, there are the certain modern types of tourism which got developed in the recent years. They are annual holiday tourism. Industrial tourism, seasonal tourism, international tourism, group tourism, sports tourism, health tourism and farm and rural tourism. So this is, uh, it is a developed in the recent years of the tourism. Now, uh, next we discuss the topic international tourism. International tourism is undertaken to international tourism is undertaken to visit the places visit the places of international international importance and to gather knowledge to gather a knowledge international uh, to gather knowledge about international culture and customs international international culture and customs. For this, there are the certain travel from the formalities to be filled by the tourists such as passport, visa, foreign currency, air ticket, travel insurance and other immigration details. So this uh, procedure is 
uh, adopted in the international tourism now let us discuss the uh, recall that point what's the name of the lesson tourism it is a derived by the english uh, english the the old english word uh, touring so the the three major the components of the uh, tourism attraction accessibility amenities another one type of the uh, tourism historical tourism eco tourism cultural tourism international tourism recreational tourism religious tourism in recent years so many uh, follow the tourism holiday tourism annual uh, annual holiday tourism seasonal tourism and sports tourism thank you